I, think I, right. shot, I shot like one time and I was like, uh, no, nah, I'm not doing that. Not you should, that. You sh There's a reskin of him at the end and he's fucking hard. He just <laughs> does not die. It's like cycle after cycle of beating him. It's that kind of cheap shit. Jesus. It's like, yes, I just scraped by by beating him. Now I gotta beat him again. <laughs> All right. <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> All right. How do we get the metal box? You gotta become metal yourself, mate. Exactly. Tension, read before dive you get. If you stay under the water for too long, you'll run out of oxygen. Holy shit. Turn to the surface for air or find an air bubble or coins to breathe while underwater. I knew that. No, you didn't. It's it's stored in the synapses of my brain. You read it from the assets. The asset. The script. The fucking coding. Did you know that 75% of coders are named Cody? Bro, that kind of makes sense. It's pretty wild. It kind of makes sense. <laughs> kind of like, uh, like back in the day, you know, your last name really decided a level of occupation you was going to have. Well, you got your last name from your occupation. Yeah, like a blacksmith last name would be Smith. Ah, or, or or that took a lot of health away. I know. <laughs> You're telling me. You gotta go spit on him. <laughs> fuck, fuck you. Fuck you. You're a fucking degenerate. Kinda you'll never amount to anything. Kinda You're reminds me of JMash97. You're a fucking eel. That's all you'll ever be. <laughs> you want you to stay in your little hole? Like the little puss boy that you are. Bro, is this flying an emo? I forgot how to get him out of there, honestly. I think you gotta give him like true love's kiss. True love's kiss? <laughs> then he'll turn human. Yeah, bro, exactly. Then he just swim Oh! Up. <laughs> Everything's out to kill me. That's kind of a scary reality for Mario. Everything's out to kill him. I would complain and be like, yo, you shit at this game, but to be fair, I was kind of shit at Crash. Bro, it's the fucking controls. How am I shit? I've gotten like seven stars. <laughs> I have a feeling that I'm gonna die. Horrendously. Tremendously. <laughs> oh, he's out. Oh, he's out. It's about time, dude. Fuck. I missed it. Oh, you were trying to go in there? Yeah, you got to. <laughs> Fuck. <coughs> yep. 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 This is it, boys. Yep. This yep. is it, boys. Let me get in the hole. Just let me get in there. <laughs> oh, no. Don't. Come on. Where's the coin? Where's the... Where's the... <laughs> no! I hate swimming in this fucking game. I hate secret levels. Sometimes. I think you have to collect all the red coins. Secret levels can go from like being like super fucking easy to being like extremely fucking challenging. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's a good um yeah. It's a good um observation. Uh, the only the only bad part about secret levels now was most of the time you had to pay for them. What? <laughs> so they're not secret levels. <laughs> this is so much for like games that come out now. They have DLC titled Secret Levels. Hell yeah, mate. You yeah, sure you it's not like it. bonus content or yeah, they actually it. say? No, no, no. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's just like bonus content. But, you know, they don't put secret levels and stuff anymore, for the most part. Mm, there's still- there's some in DMC5. Is there? But I- I guess they're not exactly secret, you just have to, like, kind of do a puzzle and it's just like a, bo a bonus level. But I- I guess you could kind of put it in that category of being a secret level. But is that because they want it to, or is it like a... Yeah, they want it. Or is that like a... No, 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 I mean, like... 
is that not like a just a DMC trope at this point to uh, to have some in there? Well, yeah, but it's still nice to see in a 2018 game. Yeah. Hell trying, yeah. I'm, I'm trying to think what? if I remember any in the remake or not. Called the American DMC. That's the British one. It's the British one. You know that, right? No, I always call it the American version. It's oh, <laughs> Ninja Ninja Theory is a British developer. Uh, yeah. So I'll just say English then. There's there's no there's no uh, secret levels in DMC Devil May Cry, but there is a secret good game. You say it's the it. secret good game. Like, there's a secret good game behind the surface. Like, the surface <laughs> is just like an edgy, stupid story, but it's like a good game. Uh, I feel you. I feel you. Like, a good game to play. Yeah, I, I remember enjoying it when it first came out. Like, the gameplay and the combos are fucking sweet. Yeah. Like, that and... I always, I always mention this. That and uh, uh, Metal Gear Rising came out around the same time, so those yeah. were really... I guess Same the two year. games, yeah, that defined my 360 days, because I, I got it really late. Your Mountain Dew game days. Games. Yeah, my, my, my Mountain Dew days. Crack open a Mountain Dew and play Xbox. Bro, I be, I be, uh, I, I don't crack open Mountain Dews, mate. I forgot what's it called, uh. You know, you know how people do beers and stuff when they like punch a hole in. The oh, uh, shotgun. Or, yeah, I think it's called shotgun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's called shotgun, shotgun. Yeah, that's what I do to my Mountain Dews, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Those were the Mountain Dew days, mate. <laughs> there's no point in doing it with a fucking soda. <laughs> I mean, there's a reason why I do it with a beer, but soda is for sipping and casually enjoying. Yeah. Whereas beers are fucking disgusting, and you want them to. Hit your system as quick as possible. <laughs> That's why some people even put it up their assholes. Jesus Christ. They literally do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I remember. Uh, uh, I remember seeing it in that one movie. What was it called? When I went to prom, the the whole lobby was filled with vodka soaked tampons. <laughs> What was it called? That movie with, uh... What was it called? Stepfather? D Stepdad? The one with John Cena? <laughs> no, no, no. Fred? No, oh, god damn it. <laughs> yeah, Fred. <laughs> yeah. Well, it was, was John Cena his real father or his stepdad? No, it was like, uh... It was just like... You know, because I think lore was Fred was just fucking crazy. Yeah. So it was just like what he. That was like his carer. Father. It was, was like his just, big. It was just who we imagined like his father to be. Like it wasn't like even his... real. He wasn't uh, even real. Really? Yeah. Uh, it just it's not to... like a. It wasn't like a big brother system. No, it wasn't even real. It just like hmm. who we imagined his father to be. Hmm. Do you remember that episode of Pokemon where like the guy held Ash like a gun to his head? Yeah, 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 yeah. Why can't we get more Pokemon like that? Man, I think it was a band episode, but yeah. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> yeah, it's a fucking. <laughs> Someone's threatening to blow Ash's brains out on a kid's cartoon, so yeah. Kind of makes sense. Yeah. There's a lot of this... interesting band episodes of Pokemon. Like when uh, Brock opened his eyes? <laughs> yeah, mate. Yeah, mate. Definitely. Whoa. That's not supposed to be shown. I think uh, the most recent one that I can remember of was... Uh, there was this one episode for... I think Sun and Moon. Where... Um, Ash was... Um, um, pretending to be one of the... Um, 
one of the uh, monkey Pokemon, so he like painted his face black and stuff like theirs. Oh my were, gosh. And they were like, yeah, we probably shouldn't put that in the West. <laughs> so yeah. What's that black face Pokemon? What's that black face? You know oh, the one I'm talking Jinx. about, right? Jinx. I'm assuming you're talking about Jinx. Yeah. <laughs> Did that make you fall in love with Pokemon? Yeah, bro, exactly. 